The car seat lady loves baby wearing. We've worn all of our babies, grandbabies, and nephews for more hours than we can count. But there's a time and a place for everything. Baby wearing should never, ever happen in a car or a taxi. Here is why. What you saw was a slow speed crash, just 21 miles per hour, or for the physics buffs, 9 Gs. The adult dummy was wearing just a lap belt. The infant dummy, weighing 20 pounds, was worn in a baby Bjorn. Just two tenths of a second into the crash, the carrier breaks, sending the infant flying. Why'd the carrier break? The 20 pound infant effectively weighed 180 pounds due to the crash forces, which is much more than a fabric carrier can withstand. Now, if you're thinking, what if the adult wore a shoulder belt over top of the carrier, then wouldn't the seatbelt prevent the baby from flying? It might, but it brings its own whole host of severe risks to the child. First, the adult's chin is right above the baby's soft spot, and as the adult's head flies down in a crash, the baby is at risk for brain injury. Also, the adult experiences the same crash forces and will also effectively weigh a lot more. In this case, 1,500 pounds, which would crush the baby. So, now that you're not going to wear a baby in a taxi, check out thecarseatlady.com for tips on choosing a taxi-friendly car seat for your child.